A South Korea has successfully launched its all-domestically produced Nuri space rocket. It took off from the Naro Space Center in the country's southern coastal village of Gohyung at around 4 p.m. local time. The three-stage Nuri rocket was designed by the Korea Aerospace Research Institute. It was developed using Korean rocket technologies. South Korea in 2013 successfully launched its first rocket into the orbit, but that was jointly developed with Russia. The Myun Sook tells us more. Oh. It's the result of more than 10 years of research and investment. South Korea finally succeeded in putting its own satellites into orbit 700 kilometers above the Earth. In the first test in October last year, it failed to place a dummy satellite into orbit. The government said on Tuesday, Nuri, which means the world in Korean, successfully put into orbit a rocket performance verification satellite and four cube satellites domestically developed. Since 2010, South Korea invested about 1.5 billion U.S. dollars into developing Nuri, and around 300 companies have taken part in building this homegrown rocket. President Yoon song yeol who according to the presidential office watched the rocket being launched live, congratulated everyone involved in this launch, saying the successful launch now opened up the path to space for the country. He promised to set up an aerospace agency to provide more systematic support for the space industry. This successful launch now allows South Korea to jumpstart its space program and build its own satellite-based navigation system and and a 6G communications network. And although government officials have denied it, some experts say it is possible that South Korea could also launch a range of military satellites as North Korea continues to upgrade its military capabilities. The country now plans to carry out at least four more launches by 2027, and it also plans to send a spaceship to the moon by 2030. Lim Yang-suk, CNA, Seoul.